Good morning, everyone. Demi Q here, live from Fairport, New York. Tatu and I are out on what's starting to be a snowy morning. When we headed out, it wasn't, so we just do the best we can. So I just wanted to come to you with my American Cancer Society 2021 and 2021 event. Um, as always, I just want to make sure that I say thank you so much to everyone that's supporting me. And uh, day by day as I step, hang on, that's my reader. Um, we'll just keep sharing all the, uh, all the stories and different things that are making me want to do this for everyone. And uh, I hope inspiring you to uh, support and do something as well. So um, today, my dedication goes out to Joan. She is somebody that, as some of you know, I'm originally from Buffalo, that was in my life in Buffalo. I had the immense honor of having her as my leader for a short period of time at work. And uh, shortly after my battle with cancer, Joan um, had that journey put in front of her. And Joan is a, a powerful woman. And when I say that, I mean the power that comes from within her to show up every day and serve at the highest level is just unmatched. Um, she, i going to switch to the other side of the street. She, um, good morning, Janelle. Good morning, Michael. Um, she was my leader. And there was a time when I was out with uh, knee surgery, not relating to the cancer, just out with the knee surgery. We're going to cross the street here. And um, it was time for a United Way. Come on, Tattoo. It was time for our United Way donations. And I didn't get the card at home. And I didn't even realize it was going on. And she called me personally on the phone to talk about it. And she was just saying, you know, the importance of United Way. And there's one sentence she said to me. She said, Deb, what this is all about is when others cannot. We need to show up when others cannot. And she said, someday we'll want someone to show up for us. Joan, I'm showing up for you. Joan, we are in this and we can do it. You are a cancer conqueror, bell ringer, and uh, you made a huge difference in my life. And it is an honor for us to come back at this point to uh, continue that. So, little side story. My brother Michael now has the honor of working with her. And uh, when I heard that, I just thought, I know he will have as impactful moments with her as I did. So, I'm going to put my glove back on because right now I'm running without a glove in my phone hand. And Joan, I just want to thank you. Um, guys, Joan battled lung cancer. Get part of her lobe removed. It came back continue, to continue on. And um, she makes a difference in people's lives every day. And the world is a better place for her. So thank you so much, Joan. All right, hands cold. See you guys. Hi, Sarah. How are you? Bye, Michael. Bye, guys.